it a thousand times where someone's been asking the question over and over again, does this suck? Uh, hello. It is nice to internet see you all again. Uh, shakes to all the people that I haven't met before. Uh, this is Story Luck. I am Daniel Andrew Boyd, and I will be telling a 99-second story. Jenny, this eighth grader, runs down the stairs to where we're ditching class. Tiffany, you have to read this. Does it suck? I cannot date a boy who sucks at poetry. Tiffany unfolds the piece of paper and then hands it to me. Dan's the reader. I'm looking it over, and the first thing that I notice is that it's been folded and unfolded a thousand times, where someone's been asking the question over and over again, does this suck? I don't know about poetry. It rhymes in some places and not others. It doesn't make a lot of sense to me. I'm a precocious seventh grader, but I am not so precocious that I critique poetry. I tell them, I read fantasy novels. But the thing that I can tell you about this, the thing that I notice, is that whoever wrote this did drafts. You can see that there was paper on top of this where he crossed things out. You can see in the indents that he moved the words around. So you've got to ask yourself, are you the sort of girl who wants a guy to put his heart and soul into something? And if so, does it matter whether it's good or not? Jenny runs with a smile back upstairs, and Tiffany squints at me and says, It sucked, didn't it? This is a story that uh, is on the Grit podcast, and there's a link below. And I also want to say it would be really cool if you signed up for our 99-second storytelling contest. Bam! And what else can I say? Uh, thank you for listening. Like, subscribe, and hit that bell for the notifications. Uh more 99 seconds stories as the future moves closer to fruition.